Hello everyone. Welcome back to the nursery. My name's Vicki. Guys, this is the full-bodied silicone I've been painting. This is the Joy Sculpt full-bodied silicone. Uh, she's poured in the really, really soft silicone. She is super, super soft. I just got her painting finished, guys, and I wanted her mom to see her. Let me bring her up so Mama can see her beautiful face. Now, you have to hold her, support their heads, guys, just like a real baby you would. Um, yeah, I'm going to show you some of this. She does wrinkle. See that? She wrinkles. I want everybody to see that. She wrinkles. Uh, I was noticing down here on her little legs. Let me get her up here, guys. Uh, if you can kind of squish them up. I don't know if you can see it or not, but let me see. Look at the wrinkles in her little leg when you push this together like real skin. Isn't that real? Isn't that something? But, uh, yeah, she wrinkles. She's done in really soft silicone. She's a beautiful baby, guys. Uh, I done her in a very newborn baby look. I want her to look like a just-born brand-new baby. She is, uh, I done her in the really, uh, like, pink skin tones. Red and pink skin tones. She's not too red, but... You can see she's got some blotchiness about her, and she's got her veining shows pretty good. See that? She's got some blotchiness. Now, my camera may be picking it up a little redder than she is. It looks like it is. I got her under real, real bright lights, guys. Um, yeah. So, her her red may be looking a little bit red, redder than it is. Uh, yeah, and she's all done, except I have a few touch-ups. To do on her uh i had a i don't know what's causing this right in here guys it's like a um it i, I mean i put the powder on i know that's the the matting powder let me get her up here see, I don't, see if it'll focus anyway it's right in here and it's like a white i think that's the the matting powder um uh, i'm gonna have to go back in and do something to that place i found a little shiny spot right in here that's all and then i had a, a problem with her little wrist right here like that right there i'm gonna have to go back in and put some more silicone and uh, i'm gonna have to put that little hand together like that so that will stay and uh but other than that she's finished with her painting i will be putting her on the rooting uh pillow probably tomorrow i was gonna do it tonight but guys it's getting really really late and i am just dragging today i don't know what's wrong with me i'm super tired today and um uh, but I think I'll probably start it tomorrow because, you know, I, I want to be on top of my game when I do all this to the babies. I try to do as much perfect, perfection. I mean, you know, nobody's perfect, guys, and do them absolutely perfect. But I try to get as perfect as I can on them. But anyway, there she is. This is the Joy Sculpt. And I, she is 18 inches long. She weighs, I can't remember exact weight, but she's right at 6 pounds. And uh, just like a six-pound baby. Very beautiful baby. Soft. And, and the matting powder I use, guys, is called... Um, a lot of people have asked me this question, and I want to answer that while I'm on here. It's called Just Matte, and it's by 3D Creations. And to me, guys, I've tried a, several of the uh, different matting powders. And to me, it's the best. And so that's what I order. It costs a little bit more, but it's really, really good. And that's what I use. So, I wanted everybody to know that. I've, I've had a few questions on it. And I thought I'd ask. I mean, I thought I'd answer those questions. And, um, yeah. So, that's the matting powder that I use. It's, it's called Just Matte by 3D Creations. And it makes them just so silky, soft, and smooth, guys. It's just like it's just like they've got on baby powders, how they feel. Their body is so smooth and silky and soft. It's just like they've got matting powder on. I'm not matting powder baby powder uh in there yeah it's really nice so anyway i want you guys to see her and especially her mama she's very see look even when you push up on the arm can you see the wrinkles look at the wrinkles in that it looks just like real skin isn't that something it wrinkles just like real skin it's very nice so but i thought i'd let everybody see her now guys you do have to support the little heads just like a real baby um, uh, you know, they're just, they're just like little, a real little baby. You have to treat them as such. Um, silicones are a little bit more tedious to take care of. 
because you have to be so careful with them, guys. They can get torn. Uh, if you pull on their arms or their legs or anything like that, they can get torn. And, um, yeah, Mama T, if anybody watches her, Sharon T, um, she had a silicone and had a little rip in the neck, and she didn't support the head, I think is what she said on there. I believe, now, don't, don't quote me on that, but I think that's what she said. And the whole head just ripped off. And so uh, she was asking, could she fix it? And, of course, it is repairable, guys. She can put it back on. But it's just, you know, that's what I say. You These tear real easy, guys, because they're super, super soft silicone. And they'll tear real easy. So you have to be very careful with them. And when you're painting them, I mean, dressing them or whatever, you have to uh, take care not to pull on their arms or the legs, like pull their arm through the sleeve. You got to kind of, um, you got to pull the sleeve and not the arm, right? When you're putting clothes on them. And it's like that, you know, actually pull on the clothes instead of pulling on the arms. You know, you can't just reach inside a, uh, a sleeve and grab their hand and just pull their arm through that sleeve. You can't do that. You have to move the, pull the sleeve up on the arm. So they're a little bit more tedious to take care of, but they are, they're very beautiful guys. And, um, uh, yeah, and I permanently mat them. So you don't have to powder. You can, of course, if you want to. I mean, you know, that's up to you. If you want to powder, but you don't have to. I put a permanent matte finish on them, and you don't have to powder them. They just stay real smooth and silky soft, and uh, just like they've got baby powder on. But anyway, uh, I, I can make some more of these guys. If anybody's interested, you let me know. I do have a payment plan. I asked for a deposit, but I do have a payment plan. I have several options. The reason I don't tell the prices on here, guys, is because I have uh, several options. For people to choose from, uh, you can have, you get a baby just painted, and it will be a certain price, like if you want it bald. Uh, you can get a baby fully done with uh, the painting, the hair rooting, and a full box opening. Um, and it's a price, you know, a certain price. Or you can just get the baby with no box opening. You know, I have all different prices like that. But if you will message me down in the description, you'll see a little thing below if anybody don't know what that is um if, you know just click on that where it says description and it'll open up the description of it and i have some links i'll have some links there where you can contact me either on facebook messenger or um instagram now i do have a gmail address uh, email but i don't ever hardly put it on there guys because really i check the other the most that's what i check the most and I would rather get the messages through that because I'm really I'm all the time checking that, make sure I get everybody's messages. But yeah, anybody's interested, you message me. We if you want one of these babies, we can work out the details. This girl is going to get uh, I ordered Delta Dawn hair for her. It's called Baby Brown, and I'm going to do it in a uh, like a real babyish hairstyle. Um, you know, it's not going to be real super super thick. It will have she'll have hair. But it, it's not going to be like a big, thick, super thick head of hair. And, uh, I mean, she'll have a lot, but it won't be like super thick is what I'm trying to say. It'll be more babyish, like a little baby's hair, you know. And that's what I'm going to do on her. So, yeah, this girl will be going on the reading pillow soon. And I just wanted everybody to see her. And I hope you like her mom so far. But I'm done with her painting other than a few touch-ups. Okay, guys, that's it. I will talk to you soon in a new video. Uh, I appreciate each and every one of you, and as I say, if you're interested, just message me, and we can discuss it, and of course, if it's too much, and you know, it's fine too, you know, uh, you do, you know, you have options there, though, as I said, and, uh, and I can paint you a baby, and she can stay bald, or however you want to do it, okay, guys, and I guess that's it, so I will talk to you soon in a new video, as always, thank you so much for watching, bye-bye.